Let's find out if there's any fish around today. I get right here though. My toy go to Berriana over there. We went over with Dolby before. I'm gonna try to go all the way to the end and see if there's any fish here. Normally my brother and I used to come over here and fish. We already uh, caught a few people over here right now. I'm trying to figure out if, uh, how how it is out here. If it's gonna be productive or how it's fishing a lot in this spot. How'd you guys do? We got here. Oh, you guys just got here right now? All right, good luck. Okay, yeah, try to fish out of here. I guess a good spot there. Yeah. Are you uh, up with locals over here to see if they're catching anything? Just park it over here real quick. All right, there's some peeps over here. Yeah, Clifton Court for a bay today. Alright, see what's up. Alright, just set up here. Clifton Court for a bay, baby. It's the old stumping ground again. Yeah, it's been a decade over here. Maybe more than that. So there's quite a few people over here right now. Here you go. This is, I'm at the very end of it. Peaceful and quiet. No wind and um, temperature is not it's not that bad. It's not really that cold cold. So there's my pool. There's a truck. I can just chill inside, do my work, wait for the fish, whatever, and see how it progresses over here. Aqueduct's been no activities lately, so I try to find a different location. The fish uh, somewhere close by the house. Here's the spot. My slack. Maybe like another baby striper again here. Let's take a look. Let me see if I can turn this on. All right. Okay. Let's, let's get down over here. I know I got something here. gonna have to go step into all these rock areas here that's the only thing about this place you need to um, find yourself like a good base so you won't go down in the water so far there's one in here oh yeah there's definitely some, maybe a small one here it took it though it took that though so let me see maybe a small one again Let's find out. It's getting heavy though. What do we got? Oh, we got another one here. Not a stripey. We got two in the house. Oh, shit, I even caught a line. Whose line is this? Got a line too. All right, I don't want to get, I don't want to get spoiled with that line. There you go. Here we go. Clifton for Bay, baby. When I got his conk, the second one for the night. It's not a keeper, but definitely they're hitting here on a pal, on a pal room here. Clifton for Bay, baby. Getting hits. There you go. Another one. <laughs> Two in a row, but you know what I mean? <laughs> it's fun bro I mean you know catching or not catching you know what I mean all right so we got another one here all right let's go baby hope the big ones will come in they're ignoring the um grass shrimp though all right let me take this out got another fish here I think I see it bobbing I just need to figure out where I'm gonna pick this up at all right, so we're gonna go here. The only thing around here of Clifton is you got all these jagged rocks, and <clears throat> you can hurt yourself here if you don't know 
or you step into these rocks and you s slip, uh, you you can freaking fall in the ground and you know bump your head and all that shit and get a concussion. So you just have to be careful. So right now, looks like I have one here. Maybe it's another baby striper. Let's take a look at it and find out. All right, let's see. I know there's a bite and I can see my bullet bobbing so I probably hooked up with like a small one again here yeah most likely here you go not a one a little bit not a baby one here <clears throat> so we got another striper here you know a baby striper Yeah, I wish it was a big one though. All right, so let's go ahead and um, I'll take another picture of this on my phone and all right. Okay, so we do this. All right, so here you go. Get another one. <laughs> All right, let's just get this guy right now. Uh, relax, I got gotcha. you. Okay, we're gonna make this guy kind of swim back. All right, here you go. Swim. Here you go. He's out there. He just buried himself underneath the rocks, but he'll he'll survive. All right, that's three. All right, I'm gonna rebate. All right, so I think I have a little bit more pile worm in here. Actually, I got quite a few more that this fish can party on. I have this pile worm for what a couple of days now. And with the cold weather, um, kept them in my garage and it remained cold there. It's going at least, I think the temperature is like about 46 degrees. And they're still alive. So I'm gonna try to double up my bait to consist it. Some of this, some of this like power that I have, uh, they're kind of small already. It's a leftover power. I'm just gonna put two in here on this hook. That's what we've been doing so far. I've been putting like two. And it's just gonna look like that right there. This what I do and seems like that works all right so let's go out there and cast this out and hoping that we can land another fish we'll see it in this spot looks like this spot right here is not that treacherous um, I can cast it out there they're kind of far the fish are kind of far so I'm just gonna step right here in this spot and Cast it out there. Let's see. Hope that I can kind of all right. I think I hit a good spot there. That's where they're hitting at. Right before that that hill or that island there, I should say. Okay. Let's 
put it here and say goodbye. I have grass shrimp on my other fishing pool, but they're seem like they're not interested in that. They're more interested on the pile worm. All right, here we go. Let's put him back here again. Wait for the bite. All right, start the line. There you go. Let's go and wait. Here we go. It's about a few of us here. Nice day out here, though. No wind. Weather's perfect, so. As you can see, it's glass. I don't know if you guys can see that. The water's glass. Catch you guys in a bit. Fuck. Because I know they bit this one a while ago. It's like, all of a sudden, it stopped. Yeah. Dude, if freaking they hit grass shrimp and. The freaking power worm, bro. The power worm? Power worm. Oh, power worm. Power worm and this grass shrimp, dude. You start hitting it on the grass shrimp. You catch big fish in the grass shrimp, dude. Yeah. Damn. This motherfucker about to lip him. <laughs> oh, it's freaking coyotes around here, huh? Oh, there you go. I can get that out. Yeah, he swallowed that one, huh? It's right there, bro. It's in his <laughs> guts. Damn. There it is. I don't know if I can make it out there. I'm boomerang this guy. There you go. I'll try to uh, throw him back in the water there. Oh shit. He probably gonna die if I'm just gonna toss him up hella far. Try to keep him like close. Ugh. All right, fishy fishy, here you go. Go swim. Come on, make it. All right, nose caught here. Him? There you go. Got one. Clifton for me, baby. Right, let's go try to release this back. I try to get away from the rocky area there. Try to come on this side here. I think that's more. Oh shit, that's kind of steep. It's kind of steep in there. I might roll over. <laughs> it's kind of steep in here. I hope I won't freaking hope I'm slipping here. Shit. Whoa. Ugh. All right. Time to release this guy. Slippery here. Later. All right, so we got another one here. All right, let's go, baby. Hope the big ones will come in. Here you go. All of a sudden, the fucking ranger shows up, bro. Another one. 